Good morning, Pisces. How are you? If you'd like a reading, text me at 313-401-3707. And two hours, basically, is 240. That's over the phone. I call you. A one hour is 120. I call you. A 10 card is 35. I call you. Five card is 25. I will call you. And a one card for $10, your answer will be text to you. There's no reason to call. <clears throat> so, Pisces, let's get on because I pre-shuffled, okay? So, um, the first card that I get is Leap of Faith. It's safe to make the moves you're considering. So, Pisces, whatever moves that you're considering, please leap, make the Leap of Faith. Please make the Leap of Faith, okay? Let me straighten this out, sorry. Please make the Leap of Faith. You have to, whether you want to move. You're scared to move from your place. Make that leap of faith. If you want a new relationship, make that leap of faith. Okay? Whatever you feel that you need to do for you, don't listen to other people. Listen to you because people will always give you some fucked up advice. Okay? So you need to make the leap of faith for you. Got to stop listening to people, Pisces. Spiritual lesson. This person is in your life to, to teach you a lesson, a spiritual lesson. So are you with somebody that's fucked up, that's, that is mistreating you, that's not treating you right, that um, needs to grow up themselves and needs a spiritual lesson within themselves? You got to let this person be who they want to be and you're going to have to be who you want to be. And some of you I'm picking up psychically need, um, I feel like some of you are dealing with an ex. An ex is an ex for a reason. Uh, some bullshit. Um, and also I'm hearing that you need to move on within your life. Let the dust settle what I'm hearing and you need to move on. You really do. I am empowered. You are very empowered within yourself. Successful. You are very successful. And I am making bold changes. So Pisces, some of you are really making some great choices. Choices that you never thought that you could make. But you have to. Sometimes the universe will push us to do things that we don't want to do. And right now, Pisces, I think that you're making a great, bold decision, some bold choices within your life to leave people alone, even friends, lovers, uh, husbands, wives, whoever it may be, you're making a great choice to move forward within your happiness, okay? You've got the Five of Swords. So the Five of Swords is an out certain outlook like that's where that leap that's where this leap of faith comes in okay you have to make that leap of faith decision in a certain outlook you're not too sure about it you're not too sure should you do it but you should um chances of loss at defeat so some of you might take a loss whether it's in a divorce the marriage uh, you might have to downsize, but some of you are going to have to take a loss. Um, if you have to downsize, have a garage sale, make money off your shit. You know what I mean? Um, some of you are definitely going to have to downsize though. Um, uh, entertainment purposes only. This is not going to resonate with everybody. A lot of people don't do deaths. A lot of people don't do pregnancy. A lot of people, I do it all. Okay, so this is entertainment purposes only. Don't go running around and say, oh, my God, this, this, and this. No, um, somebody has died around you or somebody that you know is sick that's got cancer, uh, lupus, um, <clears throat> heart disease, kidney disease, liver disease. Uh, some of them are uh, in the hospital now. I feel that somebody's waiting for a liver transplant, kidney transplant, and something's wrong with the back, with the spine area, okay? But definitely some of you um, have been through uh, a loss or going to have a loss, okay? 
and that's not for everybody. A lot of you are happy at this time. A lot of you are happy, glad that you uh, made the change. I am spiritually protected, so you don't have to worry about anything, loves. You are very spiritually protected. Now you've got the seven of coins. A lot of you have a lot of anxiety because of changes. You're impatient. You, you're, you can't be patient at this time. Um, let's see. You're uneasy about some things. What is actually going on within your life? Some of you are at a loss of money. Maybe you're ready to get on unemployment. Uh, maybe you just lost a job or you're waiting to get a job. You will. Do not make any unwise investments. People are in the stocks like crazy. Uh, I wouldn't make, Pisces, I wouldn't make any unwise investments at this time. And the economy is still unstable. Okay? The virus is still out there, so start, keep saving your money, okay? And then the Six of Wands. You're going to hear some good news, believe it or not. There's some good news coming your way. Um, this inset. Um, there's some advancement within your job. I see, do see in a promotion. If you haven't gotten one already, this is for the month of October. It could have happened, started in September and went over to October. This is for October. You want to be recognized for all the hard work that you're doing. You really, really do. <coughs> Excuse me. Then you have the Four of Cups. You got new possibilities coming in. You got new relationships coming in. You got new approaches to old problems. Okay, you're meeting new people and new knowledge. Okay, so whatever it is, this leap of faith that you have to take, once this door closes, you're going to have a door open to many other doors. But you have to take that leap of faith, Pisces. And your last card, Apology. You can expect the apology you want to hear. So somebody did some fucked up shit to you. Um, and you're going to hear an apology. Some of you have been longing for an apology. But definitely somebody's going to apologize to you. I'll do one more. You know me. I'm always doing one more. Somebody wants to make love to you in the moonlight. Doesn't necessarily mean love in the moonlight. But then a lot of you are getting mixed signals from somebody. So he don't he or she don't know if she wants to be in a relationship. He or she don't know if they want to move. He or she don't know shit what they want to do. It's almost like you have to make the decision for them. But then on the other hand, somebody's emotionally distant too. It's like you're laying in bed, they're making love to you, and you're just looking up like, what the hell am I doing? They ain't good in bed. They ain't giving me what I want. What am I doing here? You know? And then he might be saying, I'm not in love with her either. So there's some emotional things going on with you in a relationship. Most definitely. But Pisces, this is for the month of October. I will be back uh, later on in, in a couple days, couple weeks. Never know with me. But uh, good luck to you. And make the changes, uh, Pisces, that you need to make in the month of October. New beginnings for the fall. New beginnings in your life, okay? Mwah. God bless you. And uh, please make sure you hit that like, share button, leave a comment. Thank you so much. God bless.